Hello, 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 beautiful people of the internet. What was it? Ah, I'm so happy to see that we have people from the get-go today. That makes this so exciting. I'm so happy. I'm so happy this is happening today. Um, my name is Andrew. I'm here with the Library Makerspace. Um, with NCSU Libraries Hill Makerspace Department. Um, I work as a Library Makerspace technician and now um, I'm here streaming for y'all. Um, and the point of the stream today is to act as like an informal office hour situation for the Makerspace just because we do have limited capabilities but we are open um, so y'all should come and check us out. Also hello to Colin and Dorman Deus um, and also my mod, shout out to my mod, they're awesome. We love them so much. Oh my, what was it? Someone pay them big bucks, all the big bucks. Um, what was it? But while the questions start rolling in and you can ask me about anything like, hey, oh, also, I apologize. I realized I just, you know, I just realized that my name is not correct. What was it? I am not Christy. I am Andrew. Um, and I use he, him pronouns. What was it? Um, so, th so that is rectified. Oof. Also, my mask is a little fidgety today. So heads up, it might be slipping down my nose a lot. Um, but while the questions start rolling in and you can ask me about anything, um, related to the libraries and the, the makerspace or questions you have about like what was it projects you might have what was it that we could help you out with um, which I will either answer or my mod will or we both will um, was it feel free to just throw them out there we also have um, we're, we're gonna be repairing an old sewing machine that my mod gifted me for Christmas um, because it there was I don't know the exact reason i assume my mod will tell me why it's broken um but it's broken uh i need to what was it and i'm gonna see if i can fix it today uh using some of the hardware tools in the makerspace that we usually don't actually get to use a lot what was it and i'm very excited for it um what was it and we have dubbed we have named this sewing machine frankenstein what was it as befitting her as befitting their situation okay uh without too much further ado uh let's clip what was it i'm so excited to watch the struggle of repair it's ancient yeah me too me too that sewing machine has been used for ne nefarious purposes <laughs> what was it i think you're correct my mod is a very good, pure, pure, kind-hearted person, but I have no doubt that very nefarious things happened with the sewing machine. Potentially the sewing of the original Frankenstein. Um, but anyways, I'm gonna just clip to our dot cam and to transition over. What was it? Let's, let's zoom down a little bit. And then, well, bam. Here we are. I might be a little slower on chat, by the way. Just heads up. That's a thing that's happening. What was it? Because I'm just farther away from my computer. What was it? <laughs> like sewing. Colin, do you assume that sewing is a nefarious purpose in and of itself? Like, I mean, really. that, I don't know, like, an entire corner of our makerspace is just nefarious, which you are, you would be correct to assume, what was it, world domination with a sewing machine, you know, there could be, what was it, I, I could see that happening, I could see that happening very easily, what was it, at the very least, someone who uses a sewing machine could, what was it, could it, successfully attempt world domination. What was it? Also, I forgot there was a logo right here, so I'm gonna just tape it down. 
Hopefully I don't tape it down my hair in the process. That'd be great. Okay. What was that? My mod. Oh, mod. I don't, should we ask you, should we ask you what's happened to this, what's happened with the sewing machine? Okay, what was it? I thought for a second the reverse switch was broken, and I was like, hold on, what? Um, and then I, and I, what was it? Because, I'm going to be honest, we have, um, we have had machines. I say had because they are now, sadly, all corpses. Um, but we have had sewing machines in the space um, that were all, or that were Singer, was it, that were made by the same company, um, Singer. However, we didn't really, they didn't survive. Um, and also just, this one is much older. This is a much older model. What was that? So we're gonna see how this works out. What was that? Mod, do you know what was wrong with this to begin with? Have you tried turning it on? <laughs> again. You know, that's not, you know, okay, that's not the worst. That's not the worst thing I've heard, honestly. What was it? So, actually, first things first, I'm going to replace this spool of thread because I don't trust it. Not to say that it's bad, it just looks really old and too smooth. Like, here, let me grab. show you. Might I suggest putting it in rice? Yeah. What was it? You know, I'll just go out and buy roughly seven pounds worth of rice. Throw it into the, throw it into the case. What was it? Just let it sit for about 48 hours. Well, bam, it starts turning on again. I don't think the problem is the fact that it's turning on because if I remember right, I turned it on and it was fine. Let's see, we want, let's take a nice, ooh. If we're gonna go with uh, Frankenstein theme, we might as well go with purple. What was it, all I remember is that the bobbins seemed to sound weird, like it clicked or something. That's a lot of thread. That is correct. That is all the thread that we currently contain at the Makerspace, which is available for your use if you come in and use it. Uh, I am shamelessly plugging the fact that we are open. Um, because, yeah, why not? Um, so first things first, let's, I'm gonna do a test run. I just, wanna, I just wanna do a test and see how it feels. Ah, when did I get that scratch? I don't remember. Do y'all ever, <laughs> There's probably more in the basement. What was it? You know what? You're probably correct. What was it? I wouldn't doubt it if there was just a good chunk. There were there were about like four more boxes just like this, just waiting to be thrown up here. Okay. So I like this one. This is an interesting conundrum. I think it's just. What was it? I don't know whether to th thread through it because there's this tiny little hole here, but who's gonna go to the basement? I ain't. What was it? Look, I'll go to the basement. I will be the first one to die from, what was it, in the horror movie? What was it? I'll be attacked by the zombie staff members, the full-time ones. What was it? So I I'm gonna be totally honest. I always preferred like, I, I was never a zombies fan. I was more of like, if, was it for horror movies? It, I always preferred like, just this abomination. 
that is not humanoid in any specificality. Suspicious scary basements with librarian spooky. Wait, what? I see your legs on the main screen. My legs? Oh, it's the, um, it froze. I'm sorry. What was it? This happens a lot with our dot cam for whatever reason. I couldn't tell you why. It just does. Okay, we should be back in order. Yes? You can see my arms, but you can also see the chair and my hands, hopefully. Um, let's see. Okay, so. First things first, let's thread this thing. Okay, this is down. Is there a, ah, there is a small, a little bit. So I haven't actually finished threading this, but honestly. And then I assume that like, we just thread it here. Okay, this is gonna be a little gross, but heads up. We're gonna use a little spit, a little bit, get that thread end to just not fray. Okay, what is going on with us? Hold on, maybe I just need to cut off a nail. I will say, um, my mom knows I'm a little notorious for taking a hot minute to thread a needle by hand. What was it? It is not my strong suit. I'm gonna turn on the lights really quick. What was it? This is, <laughs> so how often do we stream? We stream a lot. Um, at least one, once a day, Monday through Thursday at 6 p.m. and more, ever. yes, yes, absolutely. Um, I will say, I if you came here for my beautiful face, um, all the famous fashion designers adhere to one golden rule, spit on the needle, not the thread. Really? I had no idea. Rules it. I'm not gonna directly spit on it because I don't trust my aim, but we'll see how it ends up. Mm. Come on. I believe in you. Actually, I don't believe in you, which is why I'm going to cut you off and maybe hopefully get a better thread and... This is highly unsanitary. I'd like to state this. I understand this. But I also, this, it, I am the only one touching this. Just for anyone who's worried about COVID things. Um, what was it? I don't understand why I'm having so much trouble with a needle, putting <laughs> a needle. Like, what's happening to me? Am I okay? Are y'all about to see me just pass out? Right here? I really hope not. Whew. Okay, so maybe, hold on. I have a, hun I have a hunch. What was it? It's a haunted machine, that's why. <laughs> ah! Okay. So the reason... Ah. I caught it. It's okay. Okay. So the reason that it felt thinner was because it was thinner because the needle was smaller, which makes sense now. 
Okay, so we're gonna stick with our original thread, I guess. What was it? And I'm putting back the cap on, because I don't want it to, like, fall out. That seems like a pain. What was that? Apparently, I'm just having a bad time with thread all around. Because I can't thread it through, un like, a hole that's about, an like, half an inch, or half, half a centimeter thick. Which seems concerning. Okay. So let's go with the originals. Apparently the oldies are the goodies. Well, I would have loved to modernize, but apparently the Frankenstein is is set in her is set in their ways. Wow. Uh, come on. Hello. Yeah. Well, I'm starting to sound a lot like a Mario Party character. Well, the Nintendo don't sue us because I just said the word Ma Mario. Again. Okay. Okay, I'm pretty sure it was the thread and not me, just because I threaded this in, like, roughly 45 seconds. I don't know. I feel like my mom's going to, like, fact check me and be like, actually, what was it? About that. What was it? And she would be totally correct in doing so. But I have faith my mod is a kind is a kinder person than that. Wait, hold on, where's the ah, there it is. Wait, what? Is there not a uh is there not a Ah, finally. Okay. That's a very weirdly angled blade. <laughs> Night of the Undead Thread. Actually, about that. What was it? Ah, yeah, okay. So, this is the this is the thread, right? Could you turn the machine a tiny bit? Ah, yes, absolutely. Was it? Is this a better view for y'all? I think that's better. I hope y'all have a better perspective. Okay. I just have so much thread all over the place. Ooh. Okay. So I took some scrap fabric that we have, and I'm just gonna do some sewing on it. I'm just gonna do some test test sewing on it to see if we can just run a line of stitches to begin with. Okay. Let's see this. It's stitching. I don't love the clickety clack. I think the clickety clack was the thing that um, our mod was talking about. What was it about it being? Huh. Don't love this. Sounds a little. I mean, I look at the back, and the back stitches aren't great, but I think that's just because the top tension needed to be increased a little bit. But it looks really good. <laughs> what was it? Hold on. I need to show y'all this. Also, I totally forgot to take a look at the bobbin. But you know what? It, it turned out okay. So we're going to just call that a success. Totally not like I should have. It's okay. Okay, so I sewed this. Right? Yeah, I sewed this stitch of lines right here. That sounds like me clicking my pen during class. That is very much a mood. What was it? Um, I like I press my volume up and volume button, volume down buttons on my cla during class a lot uh, on my phone, and I'm I'm very sure I what was it? I frustrate the people surrounding me. 
what was it but it's just it's such it's like an unconscious like i don't I, I try not to do it but like sometimes if i'm not paying attention to myself it just happens um but like okay so if y'all can see it's a fairly good line there's no um there's none of the bobbin thread showing and it's pretty tight was it i would like it a little tighter uh so i'm gonna up up the tension a little bit what was it and i don't love that whole thing happening i'm curious if it's because of the needle is i'm curious if it's because the needle is kind of or if it's loose in any in any way so i'm going to take this out and just put it put and just i'm gonna give it a good clean really quick with some of the excess fabric um looks fine honestly and then back in it goes what was it we're gonna hopefully it'll actually go in there we go yep and then we're gonna tighten it back up righty tighty lucky loosey um and actually i'm gonna grab a vice grip what was it and i don't think that this is advised but i'm gonna do it anyway and i'm gonna use it like a wrench and just turn it more than i can turn it by hand i think this will this will be a better yeah this feels tight maybe that rolls the problem maybe i need some lubricant i feel like they make some for sewing machines but i don't know that's a valid point i don't know do sewing machines need lubricant well i'm gonna test that it was not just hold on what was it the thread around the needle knotted knotted uh knotted around the needle what was it so i'm just trying to not cause more problems and make what was it murder frankenstein more than they already are okay so put down to note uh the bottom thread might don't might be out because ah uh, that's not true because i see some right now uh but i sewed along the entirety of this line right here hold on what 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 was it and it ex like i extended all was it i finished the stitch all the way to, to the edge um but as you can see it is an unfinished stitch what was it? They do. Go <laughs> buy that for one hour delivery. It's very clean. Yes. No, absolutely. What was it? I am being completely sincere here. My mom gave me a great gift. Like, it is a very clean, very nice machine in very good shape. Like, it's functional. Like, the Kazuki clock is worrying, but as of right now, I think it's functional. Um, what was it? Like, it seems really good. Um, and I'm very grateful for my mod. What was it? Because they gave me, like, an awesome gift. Okay. We're gonna see how... We're gonna see if the bottom is actually gonna catch this time. Ah, I have to thread it again. And hopefully that fixed the dunk 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 Hopefully. That'd be great if it did. I would appreciate that so much if it did. Oh, 
Okay, see, I can see, I can thread this. I can thread a needle. I would like to state this for the record because I just threaded it in 10 seconds. It just did not choose to agree with me. What was it? The first time. It is nice how long... What was it? Ooh, can you push on the base plate the sewing part? Maybe it's loose. It is nice how long sewing machines can last if they're not used constantly like maneuvers. <laughs> like, push it rhythmically. Uh, I mean, I can tap on it, and I'm pretty sure the only reason that it's... Because it feels pretty firm. And... Realistically speaking, there shouldn't be a reason as to why that this should it should touch the base to begin with because when I manually crank it, actually hold on, let me get y'all to see a better idea, a better view. What was it? That's better. What was it? Like. If I manually crank it, it doesn't touch anywhere. Except I now just. What was it? I rotated it the wrong way. Or I, I cranked it the wrong the wrong direction. I have to rethread it. I have very bad luck with thread. What was it? Which is unfortunate because I'm the textile person. Well, I'm one of the textile people for the for the space. Um, so it's unfortunate luck. It is unfortunate luck. That's all it is. Okay. Um My question is, why is it not touching the bottom? Currently. What was it? Want to test? Want to text me a picture of the model number slash uh, number model number sticker so I can look up info about the model? It should be underneath the manual wheel thing. Yeah, that sounds good. Uh, hold on. Let's. Okay, and now back to our regularly scheduled programming of this sewing machine making a wreck of my life. What was it? Let's see, let's see. Here's Abby. Okay. And the phone is away. Um, actually, you know what I can do? I can... I don't know if this will... Mm. Please talk, don't talk to me. Whoa, hello. Okay. I think y'all can see. Hopefully. What was it? Tell me if it if it's weird. Um, or if you liked the previous one. Also, run it like low speed so we can see where it click clocks. This is that's a fair point. Was it? actually I'm gonna zoom in so y'all can have a better view. There we go. Oh, I didn't put the foot down. Whoops. Where's the pedal? Ah, there's the pedal. Slow-mo. 
Also, please modify your voice so we so you sound slow mo too. Whoa. Looks good so far. I will say it's got a really nice um It's really like this is very nice. call these things but like the gears underneath that move it along are so strong and it's so great thank you so much i needed that well was, i needed you mod you're awesome um what was it okay so now we're gonna take a look You know what's weird? It's weird how tight the tension is. So maybe it's that. I'm gonna do some slow mo and see how it see how it see what's happening. Oh, is it? Yeah, it's going. That's a good question. You know what we can do? We can, um... You know how, like, doctors, they will, uh... I forget for what kinds of procedure or for procedures, they'll do this, the specific kinds, or for which organs, but, like, they'll take dye and they'll basically, like... I hear click back whenever the fabric grips come up. What is it? Is that what that's rhythmically in tune with? I didn't realize. Hold on. Uh, it was a cooperate with me, Thrag. Don't fight me. Please. I appreciate that greatly. But the thing is, I'm hearing this buzzing. I don't know if the buzzing is normal. What was it? Put the foot down for a sec with that clock and run it? Yes. What was it? Ah! The user's manual! My mod is amazing! Oh no, did it- please don't tell me it nodded. That would be a pain and a half. It did, but I was able to just brute force it. Okay. 
I don't know if the buzzing is normal. I know it's an old, I know it's an old machine, so I don't know if that's okay. You know, when I yank, what was it? Maybe it's, hold on. Ah, you know what I just realized? We never thought about the fact that it's going back up, right? Because we think, because like we've thought a lot about it going down and admittedly we haven't ruled out the possibility, but I think the possibility, what was it? Um, and it's, it's I think it's like probably what's gonna happen, but I think it's also worth noting that because it also goes up, the inner mechanisms, there might be, um, there might be something that's, that the, the thrusting, was it the needle, as the needle thrusts down and then thrusts back up, the back up motion might be hitting something inside here. Hopefully it's not, because that seems like more of a pain to fix. Hold on, I'm gonna see if I can just hear it and see if, Ooh, do you think the fabric grips have started to hitch on, on something? Ooh, that is a good question. What was it? Come on. Let me get a... You know, here's a good question. How do I break this into things? Ah! I really hope I didn't break anything there. What was it? I don't know if that was too much. I don't know if that was what's supposed to happen. Ah, fun. Hold on, let me see if I can. I'm gonna grab a I'm gonna grab a marker really quick and see what was it? Ooh, this machine sells buttonholes. That's cool. Oh, that is cool. I didn't realize that. Um that if you break more stuff, you can just see that like that. I am not gonna do dirty like that. What was it? Hold on, let me grab a marker. Because I just thought of a very quick You could try taking the bobbin casing out to see if there's any rusty nodules or broken stuff in there. That is true. Um, ah, this could be some more bob spring. Eh, that's where I was going. What was it? My goodness, how do I take this thing off? Because the fear, the, like, my understanding is, even if I take this plate off, if this plate is what is hitting the fabric gears, then, you know, I just realized something. Hold on. I think I know what it is. What was it? <laughs> what was it? <laughs> mallet? What was it? Forget the screwdriver, use the mallet. You have convinced me. Okay, everybody ready? No, this is 15 years old. It's like 10 years away from being a collector item. This is, this is correct. This is correct. Was it Abby, when it becomes, was it Mod, when it becomes a collector's item, we'll sell it and we'll, well, I don't know if we'll sell it. We might just keep it. But if we do sell it, we can use the money to, 
payoff arson in loans? Both of them? Hopefully? I don't know at this point. Well, I don't know what we, what we do with that kind of money. But I think I figured out what the cl clickety clank is. What was it? Good, good point. If this is ever worth millions of dollars, you better give me a cut. Yeah, I will. Um, but if you um, my question is, what is this clickety clank here to begin with? Because when I was okay, let me turn this around so y'all can see. Oh wait, hold on. I'm sorry. I didn't realize that the dot cam died again. Um, the clickety clackety. I th I think I think it's the foot. And it's it's a contact force of the foot and the um. I'm pretty sure it's the contact force between the foot and the fabric gears, because. Hold on. I have to because I turn it around and I don't have enough cord. I'm just gonna manually press it. What was it? Like, it's coming back up, and they're, they're touching. What was it? What was it? <laughs> Why are any of us here in the first place? Why do we exist? You know, considering that I'm repairing something back to life, I should probably have a better answer to that if Frankenstein ever asked me, hey, why'd you repair me? Because I don't have an answer right now, <laughs> to be perfectly honest with you. <laughs> well, is it Frankenstein exists to A, be a good sewing machine, well, is it that is real old, or B, to just make us millions of dollars as a collector's item, potentially, later in the future. The answer is sewing. What was it? I don't know if y'all are able to see this right now, but there is currently... Ah, you know what we can do? We can t t test this. We can take the needle out. I don't know why I didn't think of this beforehand. If we just take the needle out, and we hear the clickety clink from what was it? We can deduct, or we can eliminate this, or we can eliminate the needle as our pro as the reason why. Admittedly, this is gonna make. The thread, very interesting. Hold on, I forgot that we sewed a lot. Um, okay. We ready? If, if the machine starts talking to you, we got other problems. Just, what was it? I, you know what? I'm not going to comment on whether this machine speaks to me or not. What was it? I don't think y'all deserve it. No, y'all do. What was it? Probably more so than currently. Also, I'm so sorry. I totally did not realize that y'all couldn't see this right now. Okay, we're going to test it. Ah! Okay, so it is not the needle. But sadly, it is also not the foot and the fabric gears hitting. Okay, it's also not the fabric gears and the foot hitting, because I put the I forgot to put the foot down, which also eliminated the foot as the as the reason of the the dung dung dung. What was it? It looks like the no the noise lines up with the spinning metal bobbin thingy. Potentially. I'm trying to see right now if there is any. Huh? Okay. Ah! Okay, so 
currently, I'm trying to see um, if we zoom in a little bit further. Yeah. Uh, what's the dent in the outer ring? The clapping is in time with that. It is. And I'm very curious as to why it was it, which is why I took some time to show this. Um, I really wish I could take. Um, I really do wish I could take this plate off. I'm just, ah, okay. Was that it? I, wait, what was holding it in place then? I'm so confused. I guess nothing. Okay. We'll, well, now we have a better viewpoint to see, uh, for checking out whether or not, wait, this, well, is it, I think the dent is supposed to be there, but it might be misaligned. I think the dent is actually a notch that the thread is supposed to fall into when you thread the bobbin. Wish granted. Ooh. Mod, you're so smart. You're so smart. What was it? Also, I'm kind of curious, what happens if we take the black bit out? Because it seems loose. What was it? Because that might also be it. Also, I'm gonna grab some WD-40 really quick because it's dirty. It's so dirty. Hold on. weird because I really thought we had some WD-40 just hanging around here somewhere. I guess not. Um, ahem. Dormadius deserves some credit too, Ruth. I apologize. You are correct. Dormadius is absolutely correct. What was it? And they are, they will get their name. What was it? They will, they are all, they will, their name will also be considered a co-author. They will also be considered a co-author on the paper that we're going to write about fixing this, about repairing the sewing machine. Ooh, that is disgusting. We need to start a, a sewing machine repair company? Heck yes. What was it? I'm down for that. Let's do it. I believe in us. We'll just... Our main source of income will be the corpse of sewing machines that exist downstairs. And we'll make millions off of it. My skin started turning all like skeletony as soon as it touched like the isopropyl. Hold on. Yeah, like all white. What was it? I'm also rel elevated IQ. What was it? This is correct. Dormadius is also of elevated IQ. We all belong to Mensa. I think that's the. I th I'm pretty sure that that's it.
Can I take this out? I'm trying to get it. They don't want to take out. Okay, you know what? First things first. I'm gonna. I have an urge to just unscrew something right now. So I'm gonna take a screwdriver to the case at the top because. It's just going to give me more access. What was it from the top? Okay. Ooh, that is very bright. Let's turn this thing off. What was it? Hold on. This is the thing. Hello. Look at me. I am a, I am a smart boy. Heck, yes I am. Okay. Great. Now I have more access. Okay. Also, I should probably close. Ah, you know what? Let's go at it with a little bit more access level. There we go. We're just going to get give this a good clean. You know, even Frankenstein deserves some self-care and love. And also, this also just may potentially just fix it, because it might just be the rust. Like, as a, um, like Loa, like Loa Dormus was talking, or like Dorma, Dorma Deus was talking about. Cute vampire reference. Cute vampire reference to complete our sp spooky theme. So what was it? I would I would have said Q um, Hocus Pocus reference to complete our spooky theme. Sarah Jessica Parker as a witch. Oh, please sign me up. I'm gonna run it again. We're gonna see how this sounds. Was it give two tips to see if you know what those? Huh? That's a good question. I don't think so. Hold on. I don't think so. I also like using those air switcher candles. Yeah, the WD-40, what was it, is good. I just, I can't find it, what was it? And I, just, I know my boss, Justin, keeps some somewhere. What was it? I just, I think he hid them from us because he doesn't trust us. 
school of it. Which seems like such a betrayal of faith on his part, but whatever. <laughs> nah, nah, well, I'm just joking. Um, he is wonderful, and we love him. Um, where's the blade, actually? I'm kind of curious now, because there was a blade. Is it part of? Oh, it is actually part of the case. I did not realize this. You know what? We have scissors. I don't know why I'm not using scissors. Also, I'm using the case as like my impromptu holding thing for all the various spare parts that are happening right now. Where did my scissors go? Ah, hold up. Right next to where they should be. Okay. But yeah, I mean, like, we were making pretty good pro progress. We've, like, done a lot of detective work and it's turned out pretty like we we know what it's not for a good chunk of things okay so uh wait what did i get to put off again um i took it off because i wanted better access and because oh Right, I wanted to see if there was this black bit that is the bobbin holder. Um, which means I don't, I'm not completely sure how to take this apart. But I think what I would need to do is I need to open this up. Oh, okay, that's why, because I wanted better access there. Where did the bobbin go? Ah, no, this is a black head. Come on. Tiny screwdriver, do your thing. Tiny screwdriver should not perform that quickly. Uh, so we have one in our selling box, hopefully. Oh, yeah? I don't know if it's better than the tiny sewing, sewing machine. I really hope by unscrewing this that it's not like it's it's like it's fixable after this. Hold on, I'm gonna I'm turning off the light for a second so I can Oh, there we go. I believe myself can do this. Huh. Yes. Thankfully, the screw's magnetic, I think. That's when it didn't go flying. Okay. Next up, the other one. the white one first. Hold on, I'm gonna turn on the light back on so y'all can see. Actually, hold on. Yeah, okay. I'm currently taking it off. Yeah. A nice mix of relaxing and infuriating. That's a, this is a good pastime when I'm procrastinating. And with, what was it? Yeah, what was it? It totally counts as school work. What was it? We're... You're, uh... Doing an informal study on... 
school is it historical textile machines um, and the effects of time uh, on them today i.e. you can make any you can make anything count for college credit if you just make it sound jazzy enough Oh. Yes, we got it moving. Come on, screw. I believe in you. Actually, can I just use my hands right now? I can. Go hands. Who needs screwdriver? I'm going to regret those words in a second. I'm going to be totally honest. I have no clue how I'm going to get these screws back in. Because um, unscrewing them was hard but screwing them in is going to take way more t tension and force or centripetal force than I can muster from these screwdrivers. I'm really tempted to like take this bit off right now. Uh, screw it, let's do it. What was it? Okay, so I've been Googling for... I saw the fabric jerks turn in my heart. Ah! What was it? <laughs> Me too. What was it? When these models are manufactured, all I could find was that... Someone bought theirs in 1993. What? What was it? That means that this is at least 27 years old. What the heck? Maybe this already is a collector's item. What was it? Dormant days? Maybe, what was it? Like, seriously. Maybe, maybe you, you, you weren't kidding. Or maybe you were completely correct about that fact. More so than you already knew. Oh no, this is connected to this. Oh. Hmm, I don't know how I feel about that. Uh, you know what? I'm a coward. We're gonna let sleeping dogs lie. By which I mean, I'm not screwing with this unless I have to. Well, I'm just gonna take the slow route. Because, no thank you. I feel like unscrewing the top is like just destiny. Destiny. It's like destiny saying, hey, so Frankenstein ain't coming back anytime soon, ever. I hate the fact that this is in the way. Hold on, can I just? I don't know why I th thought of. I, well, I don't know why I didn't think of this before. I hope someone's keeping track of all the things that I've disassembled, because I'm not. It's gonna take me a hot time getting this back together. Oh no. Ah, there it is. Okay. Now. Gently. Gently. Okay. Oh boy. Oh boy. I don't know much y'all, but this is giving me like some major Ooh. Well, it's a major anxiety right now. What was that? 
I know this machine is older than dinosaurs. Well, there's one for, for sale on, Good, on Goodwill for 10 bucks. So, yeah, well, is it true? Especially once Andrew finishes picking it up. Except if Andrew messes it up, then that's a million hypothetical dollars on the hypothetical drain. No pressure. Pressure's on, can't be, can't be losing those hypothetical dollars. You know what? I'm rising to the challenge. What was it? I'll regret this later, but I'm rising to the challenge. You know, my mod is completely right. The fact that this is a recording and I'll be able to redo this step by step is correct. I'm gonna be spending some overtime here. Uh, what was it? But it'll be functional again, I think. Oh, right. I, that's the whole reason I did this. Okay. No! Mm -hmm. It fell down. It fell down inside. Yo, what, what do I do? <laughs> Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I don't know how to take this off. I'm gonna be totally honest with y'all. What was it? This is... Oh no. How do I take this off? How do I take the case off? Can I take the case off? That's a good question. That's a question I probably have to answer first. Is it possible to take this case off to begin with? I don't think so. Oh no. <sighs> this seems like a really bad idea, but the current idea that I have in my head is I'm going to Turn it upside down and gently shake it like it's an apple tree and hope it falls out. What was it? Ah, yes. Normandius also thought of that. Oh, this gotta be dis disassembled. Don't curse me like that. Why, why would you dance me like that? Do you have no pity for those in pain? Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. We're gonna, first of all, we're gonna unplug this. Cause I don't know how, I don't know how the cord's gonna do. Oh no, the cord's just part of the machine. Okay, that's fair. Mm. Okay, mm. that fell out, that's the wrong thing. Ah! Oh no. The floor. The floor! You gotta start lifting the screws, Andrew. You're in for the long haul. Uh, well, then I have to step very close, very slowly, so that I make sure I don't step on one of the screws. Or, I, I don't step on the screw. And I'm also gonna. Oh, also, the, 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 the dock cam died. What was it? Which meant no one caught the fact that it fell on the floor. Okay, y'all, we're gonna start hunting for the screws. Is this it? Please tell me this is it. No, this is PLA. not lost. Also, it died. Again. Hold on. What was it? Where's Waldo? 
NSFW. Wait, why NSFW? Did y'all? Oh, oh no. Did y'all? When I turned around, did y'all see something? Did y'all see something? If y'all something that y'all should not have, I'm so sorry. I did not intend for that to happen on stream. What was it? Okay, but we found the screw. Oh, I'm good? Okay, I'm good. What was it? Okay, you can't scare me like that, Dormadeus. Wait, what did you mean then? Okay. Whew. Now we can plug it in and run it, and... If it was... If it was the actual, if it was, if it was the the fabric gears, then we just know that it needs it needs a good clean. I'm pulling I'm pulling your watch. Oh. Why? I don't know. Still. Wait, hold on. Ah! I don't know if y'all also saw that, but like, that was it. Hold on. What was it? Let me see if I can zoom in. Um, it's towards the back. Like there, I think. Oh wait, no, that's the side. Uh, yes, right there. I seem very nervous. Why am I nervous? Um. Well, was it? I just I got all I got all anxious about the screw. Well, was it because it fell on the floor and I didn't think I was ever gonna find it and I would never be able to put this back together and make it functional again. What was it? I did figure something out. The Yannick makes me nervous. <laughs> what was it? Um, I think it's something to do with this mechanism here. What was it? With the fabric gear's horizontal motion. Um, because there's a distinct, like, there's something going on with the gear right now where it's making a, um, could dump if I go slow enough. Hold on, I'll show you. I'll show you. Yeah, okay, and I also don't think it's, uh, something with, like, the, like, the little gashes on the outer ring, because the sound happened, but it wasn't out here. I mean, it could have been that something was happening over here, over here, but because of this, like, there's, like, a sudden jump, um, yeah, it's catching on something. What was it? Okay, I can see the light. What was it? Also, I can definitely see like the actual light because it's very bright. Okay, so I'm gonna take apart the plate to see what we can do about this. Hopefully, this isn't reversible. Okay, the penny washer. Fun, fun thing. Very slowly. Okay. Mm -hmm. What was it? 
have to do this. No, no, yeah. I just, I don't have good enough timber. Come on. I'm gonna get some pliers in here and just pull it out. Oh, no, it just, I just need to, to unscrew it more. Still, we're gonna be here for a while, folks. It's happening at the Lord Quadrant of the Turn. So, are y'all seniors or post grads? Y'all give that kind of feeling. We are. I am not. I am not. Technically, I'm a sophomore. What was it? This is also my second year. I don't know. I, I'm under the impression. I'm or I have. I'm of the opinion that like, once it hit college, like, t your titles and doesn't really matter. What was it in like your credit number it just it's just like the number or like even like the number of years you've been here doesn't really matter either it's just how many what was it do you have the degree no we're all college students that's about it um but i'm a sophomore um i'm an engineer What was it? I'm an, I'm, an, I'm undergrad, not a senior, but senioritis. That's, yep, yep, this is correct. This, was it? Not, not that my mod is in, severely infected by senioritis, but that I am correct. Okay, I think it's good now, hopefully. I don't know why it's not letting me pull it out. Maybe there's something underneath, because it definitely, what was it, like the length of the screw? I've been unscrewing it for long enough that like, I definitely think, the, because the length of the screw is tiny, like it's really short, so I don't think it's the fact that I've unscrewed it enough, I think it's catching up in the eye. Which could be either intentional or unintentional. On the design on the design standpoint. What is also Why am I not? Is this maybe well that's assuming these screws are the same as Hold on. I'm gonna lift the big chunky boy. Because it's magnetic. Definitely really long. Maybe I just do it. Maybe I just maybe I really just do have to unscrew it more. That would be unfortunate. We're gonna be here for a little while, y'all. What was it? I'm a junior. Ooh, nice. Tiny tiny screw. What was it? That is a good place to be at, my understanding is just because classes I my like classes are okay for now. What was it? Or they're not what was it? They're not the greatest, but they are what they are. And my what was it? In my experience, um, freshman and sophomore year, but like once you hit junior year, my understanding is that you get like into your major specific classes, like the really fun ones, um, like where, you know, if you're in the major because you like the major and because you want to do the major for the rest of your life because you won't hate it, junior and senior, junior, junior and senior major classes actually start like kicking in and being interesting. Still? Okay, my question is why? Hold on, can I?
I heard something fall. I'm very scared right now. It'll be okay. Ah, oh, there we go. It was just a very, very long screw. Okay, I feel like I should say, show this for comparison. These were on the same plate. They are very different screws. Hold on. Uh, there we go. Oh, I should probably zoom out a little bit. These are very different length screws. Was it stop screwing around? <laughs> you know, you are correct. What was it? Oh. Okay. So now I know I just have to unscrew. Rescrewing this is going to take some time. I'm going to be honest with y'all. Like, I might just leave this here and, like... Because I... Like, so I can do this the next time I come in. Just because... Wow. How long are you? Well, is it? It can be an addition to the Makerspace sewing machine graveyard. No! Frankenstein is supposed to rise from the graveyard. Well, is it? In the, in the true zombie fashion that, that they exist in. Well, that was that was the point of today. Well, the, I mean, honestly, this might just be a multi, multi stream. Uh, it might we might just make this a series, just because it's gonna take some time fixing this. But like, it might take me like a solid thirty minutes just unscrewing these. Yes. We're so close. I can see it. I heard something fall again. I'm not gonna think about that. I am firmly ignoring that right now in the back of my mind. Okay, I think. Come on. Yeah, come on. Finally. Okay. Oh. Whew. It's off. It's off. Oh. I'm so tired. The Forbidden Kingdoms. We still believe Frankie will live. Oh. Hold on. I need to stand up for a second and, like, stretch my back because. Ow. Ooh. I'm gonna go home and do some yoga tonight because my back's feeling it. 
Oh. Oh dear boy. Okay. The plate's finally off. We can take a better look now. we're going to be able to get to that point. I'm going to be totally honest with you. I don't know if we're actually going to be able to see here because I'm pretty sure... What was it? Because like... Hold on. Oh, I forgot to zoom in again. I'm sorry. What was it? Is this where we talked about the sponsorship? What was it? Uh, if we were able to... What was it? If we were able to have sponsorships, this would be the time that we talk about sponsorships. What was it? Uh, but... Ooh. You know what? I'm sponsored by Abby. What was it? Or, I'm sponsored by Abby and my mom. What was it? I mean, that said, if, um... Actually, I don't know if we're allowed to say this, but I'm just gonna say this anyways. Because I am a reckless human being. <laughs> uh, who will do anything for a joke. If anyone out there watches this, and y'all are part of a real company, and y'all want to send us nice things, what was it? Or things for us to try, or free things? Free things. That is the keyword. If y'all want to give us free things to sample, you know? I'm just saying. I have a variety of things on my Amazon wish list. We are not sponsored by Amazon. I need to say this right now. We're not sponsored to begin with. Because we're not what was it? We're not making money off of this channel to begin with. What was it? Is there a screw in the hole in the middle of that thingy? You gotta what was it? Yes, we are sponsored by the library because they are... What was it? I am sponsored by the library because they pay me. Um, I don't know about the channel. What was it? I would say that the... Ch what was it? Today's stream is sponsored by Abby, just be... Or Mod, because they, um... They gave us... They gave us a sewing machine to work with to, be to begin with. What is that whole thing? Hold on. What are y'all talking about with the whole thingy? What was it? If I point towards section A, B, C, what was it? Like, corners uh, A, B, C, D. A, B, C, D. Which one is it closest to? Give me coordinates. What an investment. What was it? I mean, if we fix it and it turns out to be a million dollar collector's item, we're going 50-50 on that. Section A. Okay. Section A. Which whole thingy? Are you talking about this thingy? I, admittedly, I'm not seeing it from y'all's perspective. Something definitely just fell in. I don't know from where or why. Y'all saw that too, right? Like, I didn't hallucinate. What was it? The middle, the origin. People of the eyeball. Eye of the storm. Ah, here? No, there's not a... No, there isn't a... There isn't a screw right here. What was it? Um, if you're talking about, like, the center of the bobbin thread. It's the eye of the tiger, the yolk of the egg. The center of the raging typhoon. <sighs> My question is, what what just fell in there, and should I be concerned that that just fell in there? Because I don't know how to. I don't know if we have anything that'll like that's skinny enough to get in there. I'm gonna be totally honest with y'all. I think this is magnetic. Hold on. No, it is not magnetic. Okay, this is magnetic. However, it's too small, or it's too big. Ah, maybe. Was it? We're going fishing, y'all. Mm. 
Nah. Nada. Hold on. I need... I need lights. Hold on. I need a, um... Do we have a flashlight anywhere? That's a good question. Uh... I mean, there's a light on the... There's a light on the drill, but I don't think I would use the drill. I mean, I can use my phone. That's fine. That's fine too. I was just trying not to use my phone, um, because that seemed unprofessional. But when needs must. Hold on. What was it? And NCU does a poem contest. I think we should enter enter that. But in my humble opinion, if it doesn't rhyme, it's not a poem. We can edit it so it rhymes. I agree. We can edit it so it rhymes. It's very close to rhyming. I don't know about y'all, but I cannot see a thing. Hold on. We're gonna use y'all as my, uh... Hold on, first off. Let's zoom out. Yes. Ah, hello. 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 Underneath. Okay, interesting, interesting, interesting. Uh, I spy with my little eye fuzzy views of the table. This is fair. That is a fair assessment. Oh no, the dog cam died. Again. Okay. I can almost see the molecules. We're gonna We're gonna we're gonna have an ant my moment. Zoom. Enhance. What was it? Increase pixel resolution by 125%. That's just a uh can I pick up the underside? That is a that is a question I think is worth looking into for the answer. Uh, so many small parts. Okay, first things first, I need to close the, the bottle of isopropyl alcohol. 100% proof. Isopropyl alcohol before it spills all over this table. I can be organized. I can put this thing to back together without forgetting where everything went or losing anything. Also, I should turn off the flashlight. Okay. So. Oh, I need to zoom out for y'all. That's why y'all were having trouble looking at this. Recalibrate the doohickey. This is correct. After we publish our poem, we can write up a user's manual for this machine. Well, that's fantastic advice. <laughs> it worked. I see Ant Man floating around in the quantum realm. I was thinking that. We can unscrew it. Ah, perfect. Okay, this is exactly what I was looking for. It sounded like I cracked a seal. I'm not gonna worry about it too much. What was that? Okay, so, things that fell out of here. Two bolts, or two, uh, two wash washers, nuts. I forgot what the hex hexagonal ones are called. And then this thing which doesn't look broken, but what was it? The, it looks like a half semicircle. <laughs> to wipe up the table, yep, we got you covered. Lord that comes off. To sniff so that my isopropyl alcohol is not broken. You have luck. I would not recommend isopropyl alcohol. I would recommend whacking. 
Rules it. Wasabi does good things, though. So I'm not a medical professional, so you can't quote me on that. Uh, or shouldn't. Um, so this thing, I have no idea what this is. It looks like it's broken, but it also looks like... It's so perfect. Like, the dimensions on this are... Like, the edges are so perfect. Like, there's no jaggedness or anything. But I think it's a part. But I'm kind of scared to know which one. Or, how, or from where. Because it fell from above, which does not give good signs. Okay, but it fell. You know, while we're here, we should just really quickly wash this, or was it? Just do some really quick, uh, well, that's a lot of isopropyl. We should do some really quick cleaning because this looks so dirty. Maybe really, maybe really could sell this for. Maybe really could sell this. Is it time for us to get sponsored by Antique Rocho and go on Antique Rocho and just? make so much money what was it that looks like a broken pipe channel but why would there be a channel under the thing hmm yes this is correct I think again was it? it fell from above like it fell from the top section of the sewing machine what was it antique rocho is yes fans of antique rocho antique rocho is so good i'm glad there's also fans with me or there's fellow fans here because like oh my god it's such a good show also pbs we love pbs they're so great I don't know there's a hair here. Like, I know my hairs are long now. Well, because I grew it out, but, like... And fun fact, whenever you have long hair, it gets everywhere. But, like, seriously. I don't think I'm getting inside here. Okay. I have no clue what this all does. I'm gonna be totally honest with you. Okay, so I'm gonna turn it on and then very slowly power it on. Antique Rocho and Bill and I are some of my best memories. Ah, uh, Bill, 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 yes, oh my god, Bill Nye, so amazing, Bill Nye, the, oh wait, hold on, I can't actually sing this, what was it, we're gonna get copyrighted if I sing the actual thing, but like, the most expensive watch to be, ever to be featured on Antique Rocho is also the most expensive item in the show's history, a Swiss pocket watch from 1914 that appeared on a 2004 episode, it was appraised for 250 grand at the time. What was it? Do not apologize for chanting Bill. What was it? Chanting Bill is always, uh, is always situationally appropriate. What was it? It's a reflex. Mod is correct. Oh, wait, hold on. I don't know what this yellow gunk is. I don't know if y'all can see this. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna take a... Where did I put that? Paper towel. Uh, I'm gonna take a paper towel and I'm gonna wipe it off and see if this has been the cause of my problems recently. I have no idea what it is. I... I just tell you it is this. It was yellow gunk. 
Taco Bell yell again. Did that fix our problems? Nope. Y'all see something? Say something? Cause I there's so much stuff happening right now that I don't know where things are going. At this point, I'm just cleaning and hoping that'll do the trick. Which is a little dangerous because I also don't know how to lubricate this thing or how, if or if I should. But we're gonna cross that bridge when we when we get to it. I think, hold on, the light bulb's worse, what was it, maybe that yellow gunk is lubricant, that wouldn't make sense, is it near something that moves, I got nothing, the light bulb works, what's the name of this machine, um, the Singer Solid State, what was it, mod, what was it, uh, I sent a picture of the serial number and all this stuff to mod, so, mod, if you don't mind throwing that into the thingy, or into the chat, I'd appreciate that. What was it? I'm trying to get y'all a better look because I think it'd be really cool. I think y'all would, would like seeing this. It's just, I don't know. Hold on. I don't know. It This looks really fascinating. I'm also trying to look at the screen and see if we can take a look that way. Because maybe the camera will be able to, looking at the camera will be better, probably for perspective reasons. Sewing machine guts. Ooh, yeah, sewing machine guts are like, they're fascinating. Okay, so I think it's either the green bit or it's this bit right here um, that's like saying, what's up, Doc? Um, Ka-dunk, Because whenever I um, go real slow, right? And whatever is getting caught is getting caught. I gotta balance, I do some stuff. Okay. Well, it was good. It was good. It was good seeing you, uh, Dormadeus. What was it? We'll see you next time we stream. Bye. What was it? Yeah, we'll, we'll be wrapping. We'll be wrapping up in like uh, ten-ish minutes, anyways. But like, whenever I go super slow, and like, there's not enough motors, there's not enough power for it to actually surpass. The resist whatever it's getting caught on what was it um and then i push a little bit faster ah i guess i don't i don't know actually no clue There is some gunk here. What was it? I don't know if it's the right kind of gunk we're looking for, but maybe.
think I found the reason. Um, this bit right here, this black piece, um, that's underneath, or that's, if you flip that right side up, this would be horizontal. This is moving for whatever reason, and I can't, and I don't know why. Like, okay, if we go super slow, you'll see it. Hold on, slower. Uh. Yeah, there's just like that slightest click of this moving. I don't know how to fix it, but I now found a direct symptom on the inside, which is really nice, I think. We, we have we have more information to go off of. Only problem is, I don't know how to fix it now. I think I, I think I found it. I think I found it. Well, I think it's right here. Hold on, let me turn on the light again. What was it? Right here. Um, this bit. There's some gunk right there, which is so gross. Uh, I'm gonna have to wipe off all of these tools later. Like, if you watch that bit, hold on, slower. I think it's getting hot. This, um, because this gear rolls this bit on the inside, but this metal bit goes in and out, and the in and out bit that connects here, I think, is getting hot in some way. I think. I need to do more. Oh, the clicking keeps changing. <laughs> you are correct. Is, I don't know how to fix that and or clean that and or what to do about that. Because so far all I see right now is the fact that hold on, we're going to save this screwdriver some, from 
some preventable pain. And gunk. Unidentifiable gunk. Ugh. That is disgusting. There is lots of build up there. Well, it also, heads up to the people, there is five minutes left on the stream. So, if y'all got questions, ask them now. Okay, so I cleaned off the gunk that I could see, but I don't think that's gonna do it. Let's see. Ah, it's less. I think. It sounds less deep. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the sound. Ah, I could be wrong. It's well, it's not like I have like a direct comparison. It's not able to like, like I'm able to like compare this audio audio files directly. I guess we can go back and watch the beginning of the stream. But, yeah, it sounds lighter. And there's no gunk that I can find anymore. Where is it? But the only problem is, it, I'm pretty sure it's this bit. Or is it, do I just need to tighten the bolt more? Or is it, because that might be why it's just, because it has leeway, it can't. Ooh. I want to strip this bolt. So I don't think it's this bit. I need pliers for this. Maybe it's the gear. Hold on. I don't know. At this point, I'm just cleaning. Which is kind of nice, actually. I haven't cleaned in a while. I haven't, like, been able to do, like, minute things. Very, like, tiny <sighs> Abby, what nefarious things were happening with the sewing machine? Did you sacrifice Snack crack Crackle Pop to the sewing machine? What is this buildup? I'm so curious what this gunk is. Or as to what this gunk is. Yeah, 
You know, it might be this. It's a gunk of a haunted sewing machine. This is correct. Still there? Yes. What changed? Was there a gun here? Uh. Hey! Maybe it was all the skunk. Or was it because I. Hold on. Oh my god! The Kuzuri Clank is gone! Was it? I just needed to clean this. I did it! Wow, what the heck? Hold on, I know was it, we are technically past our time right now, but I'm very curious right now. If we just keep cleaning. There's still things to like figure out and like fix, but like, wow, we did pretty good. We fixed the clickety clank clank. Was it pretty well, if I do say so myself?
Like, it's not 100%, but, like, we're so close. Okay, what was it? But we are five minutes past our time, stream time. Um, and I would like to go home and go eat some dinner. <laughs> what was it? So, unfortunately for y'all, um, so, thank y'all so much for coming out and, um, watching, um, watching my stream. Um, if you have more questions, please contact, um, our, our ask us, our ask us desk. Um, it, this was such a blast. Um, I hope, I hope you'll come back again. Um, stay safe out there. What was it? Alrighty. Also, shout out to my mod, Abby. We love her so much. She does so many things. Someone pay her big bucks. Um, okay. But for real. I love y'all. Bye.